It is affecting me. Last night, I couldn't phone Larry King. You know, he has a phone-in show. I want to ask a question of Hef and his new bride, Kimberly. They were on, and I couldn't get through. No joke, I just couldn't get through. <laughs> also, I couldn't get through to Life magazine to order those uh, books at the Time Life books. Yeah. You ever see those ads? Yeah. They have volume two of The Great Nazis. <laughs> they have a whole series of books on Nazis. And if you act now, you get the cassette of the famous Nazi bloopers. <laughs> is not available in any store. <laughs> and I set away for that. I got that uh, bloopers. And I think my favorite rib tickler uh, was the time Hitler referred to uh, Hermann Goering as a uh, German herring. It's one of the just a lot of them like that. <laughs> How many of you uh, have, been <laughs> have been reading in the paper later about Old Faithful in Yellowstone Park? Yeah. I, I'm, yeah. Apparently, it's true. Old Faithful is taking a lot longer between eruptions. But then again, who isn't? <laughs> Not much else happening in the news. On slow news days, you just you grab anything. There's a little squib in the paper today. Did you know the first pay telephone went into service a hundred years ago to this day in the United States? First pay telephone. <laughs> so I said, there's not a lot in the news. It was actually, it was installed at the corner of 123rd Street and Amsterdam Avenue in New York City. And the very first caller was a Mrs. Mabel Switlock, who uh, opened the folding doors, stepped inside, and had her hat eaten by a humongous moth that was flying around <laughs> by, by the light. Now, come on, let's, let's hear it. Do you, it's like talking in class. Let's all hear it. Well, we were just saying if things don't pick up here in a minute, we'd have a little dance music for you. What are you two guys talking about now? You're... I was just trying to explain that joke to Freddie. There's no way you can explain it to anybody. What? You can't explain it to anybody. Well, it's just, it just was a silly sounding joke. You try those things. I don't have a chance to take this crap on the road. You come out here. Was this big moth. <laughs> anyway, tonight we have uh, we have Paul Reiser with us. Uh, a funny young man. Yeah. I love the music of Randy Travis. He is a and a lovely a lovely young actress who's one of the stars of the Wonder Years, Olivia Dabo, is with us tonight. So stay where you are and we'll be right back. <laughs> 